I'm Tricia from realfluencynow.com and for today's vocabulary lesson I want to talk about the words carnivore, herbivore, and omnivore and some other related words. Living things are called either carnivores, herbivores, or omnivores based on what they eat. Carnivores eat animals, herbivores eat plants, and omnivores eat both. The words carnivore, herbivore, and omnivore are nouns, but the words carnivorous, herbivorous, and omnivorous are adjectives that describe those types of animals. There are also carnivorous plants. I have a few myself, and I will show some of them to you later in this video. Pronouncing these words can be a little tricky in English. Herbivore and herbivorous are pronounced how they look, but in the word herb, the H is silent in the American English. The H is usually pronounced in other versions of English. And my understanding is that it could go either way in Canadian English. Also in the male name Herbert, we do pronounce the H and we also pronounce it in the shortened form of that name, Herb but not when we are talking about plants. The word herb comes from French and before that Latin, and both of those languages, the H is also silent. Now just for fun, I'll show you some of the carnivorous plants that I have. This is a butterwort. The leaves and stem are very sticky and bugs stick to it. Mine blooms about once a year with this really pretty pink flower. I also have a Venus flytrap and a pitcher plant. Carnivorous plants are kind of fun, but can be difficult to keep alive. So if you have any questions about them, feel free to contact me and ask me about them, even though it has nothing to do with learning English. If you want to follow me on other social media sites, then you can click the link over here to learn where you can find me at. Or you might want to sign up to get emails from me or learn about the English courses I have. Or you can stay and watch other English lessons here on YouTube. Goodbye, and remember, with hope, anything is possible.